That is a. <laughs> Hi, Justin. Hey, Brian. We're going to be talking about trying uh, Blair's Sudden Death Sauce with Ginseng. I have never had any of Blair's hot sauces before, uh, but people tend to enjoy them, I think. I, think I don't go to the store and buy something called Sudden Death. It feels gnarly. <laughs> I think it has, by the judging, I think, yeah, it does. It's got a little skull hanging, pretty sick. hanging from it. That's I, good I, it is, it is good packaging. This is my good buddy Justin Moniker, by the way. He is a he is a good dude, a good skateboarder, a good person, and he enjoys spicy food with me sometimes. Oh, it's gone. It's a keychain. It's a keychain. Wow. Yeah, this is a gift. You get to keep that. This is awesome. So, immediately the color of it is scary. That's extremely scary. I will say that. That is really bright. Yes, it is. <laughs> uh, let's see what the packaging says. It's kind of. Some, mo most of the time, like before I go into like a hot sauce or some sort of challenge that I'm doing, I kind of have a good idea of what I'm about to be doing. Today, I am, I really have no idea. This could be pretty hot. It could not be pretty hot, but I'm pretty. I, I think it's going to be. Um, okay, let's see. Ingredients: water, habanero chilies, cayenne chilies, pepper ex extract. Number three. Great. Extract is the number th is the third thing on the list. Salt, lemon juice, honey, cane sugar. Uh, corn starch, xanthan gum, spices, blah 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 blah, ginseng. So ginseng is the last one. And extract is third. And is third. So this is probably going to be bringing a good amount of heat to do it. Do they have like their levels on the other side? They do. So all the way at the bottom is. Okay, I think they have like I think it's, it says mild down there. Okay. So why mild death sauce, and all the way to the top is a terrifying looking like bottle of dark extract. So this is their. Third hottest sauce. Like you'd I have believe. to be the boss to get that. It'd be ridiculous. <laughs> It'd be ridiculous. It's probably like very expensive too. That like the pure like oh, extracts. Extract. Extracts are they can be like hundreds of dollars sometimes. They can just be unbelievably expensive because just take, I think it just takes like a, a lot of physical product to make it. Probably. You know. Probably you probably get very little from it. Exactly. Uh, all right. So suggested uses: use a micro drop. On your favorite dishes guessing to enhance that's not gonna your happen. Taste <laughs> sensations. I'm guessing that's not going to happen. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> Warning. This product contains the hottest known ingredients on the planet Earth. Please use with extreme caution. Brian doesn't use caution. I, I, I try to use caution. <laughs> Got a little tasting spoon, as always. Set that aside. Let's crack this thing open and see. All right, I, I like how it doesn't have like a little, little like, you know, little hole, little dabber. Little dabber. Whatever. It's got a full on. Like pourable. Oh, great. That's what this man does for a living, and he's over there freaking out. <laughs> I'm not necessarily freaking out, but you can just smell Whoa. how gnarly <laughs> it's going to be. Oh, dude, no. it's like all super dark at the top. Is it just eating it? Yeah, yeah no, when you're Casey, when you're going into a hot sauce, you have to taste it in its natural, natural, natural habitat, and then after that, you can make a determination of what it's going to be best on. All right, since you're the guest, I will let you decide how much of this we are going to be doing. It's not going to, it's going to be tough. It looks like it's a thicker sauce, it, too. It is, you're Oh, right. kind of. It's, it's pourable, which makes me feel like there's a lot of extra. I, can, I feel like I can see the extract that's in this. That is bright. Yes. Oh, wow, he's pouring it for me. I like this. He's, he's telling me how much I need to be doing. I've never encountered this. That is, I would say, a, an equal amount. I, I tried to be very fair. I'm not trying to rip you off. I'm not trying to hurt you. I think that we're. I think we're. We're. We're tied. Okay. I smell like a vinegary smell. I smell an other ingredient. You know, like I smell. I smell something yeah. else, and I feel like that might be the ginseng. I could be completely wrong. I have no oh. idea. All right. Cheers. That is a. <laughs> Oh, that is immediate <clears throat> back of the throat. That took me a sec. <laughs> it isn't like my the but my gums and my upper lip. Wow, that took a second for it to kick in for me at least. <sighs> <laughs> wow, that is really spicy. I think it's it's kind of it's honestly for for a sauce that has extract in it. It's kind of balanced. Um, mm. I, I can I can taste the extract, but it's not like I have a lighter like. 
like burning my 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 mouth like it normally it's is. Back of my throat and it got in my gum. Dude, on I've my had, upper lip. I've had experiences like you're having right now. It would just hit you, just mm -hmm. like like you swallow too fast, it hits you yeah. in the back of the throat, and you're just like, whoa. This is no good. This is this is no good. Okay, I can it's, I can feel it as always. I can feel it right here, which means that like so it's gone it's gone down my yeah. like it's it's affecting my stomach. I guess you could say my stomach's fine. It doesn't have a ton of flavor. It's just true spice, like it's, yeah. It's like, um, and it's kind of dissipating, kind of fa kind of fast for me. Is it still hanging out with you? It's hanging out, but it's it's not growing, and it's kind of my lips are really hot. I see. I I was able to avoid the the, see, the, the lip the, li it. the lip action. I, I didn't get the I didn't it. get the lip action. It's like on the tip of my tongue, and uh, so top, top of my throat, and I feel a lot like in my stomach. This is where I always get it. I always get it here. Flavor wise, what did you did you? It's think? just a true hot. Hot sauce. I know. There's I didn't know like odd flavors to it or anything. I I got like maybe a little bit of vinegar and some of the. That's what the smell was. Yeah. To me. Um, whoa. And maybe some like some sweetness from like the lemon juice and the honey, but it just came with a lot of a lot of heat, a really like, a lot fast of power. hard punch. Agreed. But it wouldn't like it's for, with a sauce made by extract. It didn't blow me away like a lot of extract extract sauces do. So I feel like this this sauce would be best for me to be added to. Something with liquid, so like chili, I, yeah, something like that, so like to bring the heat up, but you don't want to affect the flavor of it. Yeah, you know, say so like, oh, this is my chili recipe, but I want it to be hotter, without affecting flavor. <clears throat> I think this would be a good sauce to to, to make that happen with, because it's quick. It's not exactly. Like, it's just yeah, it's just pure heat. It's not yeah. pure and a natural feeling heat. It's still got my a lips. Nat, a more natural feeling heat for a sauce that is made with extracts. I think it's this is probably one of the better extract based sauces that I think I've ever had. It's pretty good. For an extract, it's not ruin your whole day type. I didn't hate this as much as no. I normally hate sauces with extracts. No. I know you're not an extract fan. Mm -mm. Justin, thank you very much for doing this. Thank you for having me. Thank you guys for checking this out. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys on the next. Hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, please click the subscribe button that you see right there, and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos. Uh, from now on, I'm going to be eating a lot of peppers. It's going <laughs> to, oh man, it's going to be great. Bye.